First on Fox, Red Lobster and Tyler reportedly not paying any rent. The property owner tells Fox 51 News tonight that the company owes her more than $80,000 and has no plans to pay anytime soon. And she's saying tonight, check please. Can we push it back? Drag it out, pay you over time because I recognize I owe you. Red Lobster and Tyler may have opened its doors, so but they don't want to pay their rent. Exactly. She's That's 89 year old Len Spencer, the landlord of the property Red Lobster sits on. We've had to use our get, dig into our reserve. Uh, account. Lynn placed her husband Michael in long term memory care in 2019. Yes. Today, she relies on Red Lobster's rent checks and her caregiver Connie there to keep her going. It's really been hard. Lynn says that Red Lobster sent out a letter back in March when coronavirus shut down the restaurant. They bickered back and forth on a monthly payment until they finally came to the conclusion at 40%. She says it was then, days later, that Red Lobster seemed to have a change of heart. That if everyone doesn't get on board and sign on to that plan, that I guess they're, you know, basically saying this is what we need to do. And if, if not, then we'll just, you know, bankrupt the company, which is its own a nightmare for people. No one wants the store to close. Spencer definitely doesn't want that. This photo you see taken this week of her sitting down enjoying Cheddar Bay biscuits for the first time since quarantine. She's supportive of them. She wants them to succeed. Oh, sure. The food's very good. I have no problems with that at all. And she's entering her 90s, but she's doing what most are doing these days, just trying to get by in these uncertain times. And we reached out to the parent company of Red Lobster, Golden Gate Capital, about these allegations tonight. We have not heard anything back.